Hi, I'm Richard Byrne. In this video, I'm going to show you a couple of easy ways to share Google Forms if you don't use Google Classroom. Now, this is something that I'm doing in my own classroom this year because I have students who come to me from a couple of school districts and therefore we're not all in the same domain and not all my students have Gmail accounts so we don't all have access to Google Classroom. So what I'm doing instead is I'm shortening the links using a couple of tools. First of all, for my students who want to complete a form on their phones, and I'd say half of my students choose that option, I just get the link to the form and I put it into qrdroid.com slash generate. You find it at qrdroid.com slash generate, the QR code generator. And I just paste in the URL. And because I'm going to display it in my classroom, I make it as big as I can and generate that QR code. And now I have a QR code my students can scan. The other tool that I'm using is a tool called Yell Key. You find it at yellkey.com. And it works like most URL shorteners. Just paste in the URL, select the amount of time you want that shortened URL to work for. Maybe it's just for an hour. Hit generate Yale key. And it gives you an easy to spell word as the URL. So it's yellkey.com slash tend. Really easy for students to spell. And that way, we don't have anything like, was it supposed to be capitalized? Was it supposed to be lowercase? Is that an O? Is that a zero? We don't have any of that because they're all easy to spell words. So those are two ways to shorten and share Google Forms links if you're not a Google Classroom user. As always, for more tips and tricks like this, please check out freetechforteachers.com and practicaledtech.com.